Hello cousins, it's Kemi. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys some of my favourite Amazon finds. I am going to be splitting them into categories just to make it easier for you guys to find on my Amazon storefront. I do plan on updating my Amazon storefront bi-weekly, so that way you guys are up to date with all the finds that I am currently loving within the month or within the year. If I don't find the exact product, I will link a similar product for you guys. So make sure you check out the link down below because because all the products that I mentioned in today's video will be in my Amazon storefront. I also do plan on doing this type of video every month now. So ideally by the end of each month, inshallah, I will be doing my favorite products or finds that I find within the month. So that way I'm sharing with you guys and you guys are up to date with my current favorite products. So the first category that we'll be talking about is beta items. I'm just gonna quickly go through about three products in this category because Everything else is mainly like makeup products. So the first product that I have been loving that has been helping my makeup slay is this Amazon Powder Puff. I cannot do my makeup without this powder puff. This powder puff is a game changer. You get 12 in a pack for a really affordable price. Honestly, I bloody love this powder puff. It applies my powder so flawlessly and it leaves my makeup looking absolutely beautiful. It is a definite must have in your makeup kit. It literally just gets in the corners of your nose. It packs on a decent amount of powder that goes onto your face. Honestly, bloody love this. If you're doing your makeup without a powder puff, I don't know what you're doing. I don't know how you're doing it, but girl, get yourself a powder puff. Like you need, you need her. Next is brushes. I love Amazon brushes because one, they are so inexpensive. You get like a good bargain for your money. Majority of my makeup brushes are either from Amazon or Shein or Morphe. Oral Technique. Obviously I have like here and there brushes from like Real Technique and other brands but the majority of my makeup brushes are legit from these three brands. Yes Shein is cheaper but you wear by like two weeks before you get your products whereas like Amazon you're paying a little bit more but you get it next day. That is why sometimes when your girl is lazy and don't want to be washing her brushes I just order like a new pack from Amazon and it's like here the next day. Come in lazy but sometimes buying a new brushes is better than me washing my brushes okay because when you have as much brush as me washing them is so daunting so just purchasing new ones is just like my way forward. <laughs> I have been using their brush set for years now and they are really good quality. Sometimes if your brushes are old, these two parts will like come apart, but that is to be expected because the brushes are cheaper. All you have to do is just get a hot glue gun, put it in the middle and just shove it back in and it's good to go. Sometimes I do get that with like my high end brushes as well. So it doesn't really matter on the price point you're paying for it. It's just the way the brush is constructed, but the actual bristles of the brushes are so soft and it does make your makeup look flawless. The only thing that I find with the Amazon brush sets is that they don't have like detailed eye brushes that are really good quality so you do have to like end up getting it from like Morphe or just like really searching for it. If I do find one I will link it down below. I have found some from Shein like really good eye brushes but not from Amazon yet but for face brushes for like your foundation powders, blush brushes, um, concealer brushes, Amazon does a really really good brush sets for an affordable price and if you have prime you get it like the next day as well. The rest of the products that I have in this category are just like makeup items that I have been loving. So moving on we're gonna move on to hair and body care products. Starting off, mine's a little bit busted right now but it is this mitt. It is a body exfoliating um scrub i bloody love this i said i'm nigerian i'm african so i use the nigerian body scrub already it literally like scrubs my body and i love it but some days when i want that extra exfoliate i want to get all that dead skin off my body i go in with this mitt this mitt is so so good like you will feel like so disgusted because of the dirt that it would just scrape off your body it does look like it wouldn't do much right now but trust me cousins this will get all the dead skin off your skin skin like it's gonna be like a baby's butt after using this your butt is gonna be so soft and like baby like i love it so much that i actually got the face version of this to like exfoliate my face as well it's a little bit smaller and days that i feel like my face is congested i love to use this i don't use this every day because they are quite harsh i use this once every three days and i use this once a week because i don't want to like harm 
my skin but i love these two if, if you want that baby skin soft you know deluxe skin you need to exfoliate your body okay speaking of exfoliating your body this is one of my favorite body scrub that i love to use i've tried so many body scrubs from multiple brands but i actually ended up liking this one because one the scent of this mango and kiwi is so yummy i'm currently using a cinnamon and sugar one but i don't like the scent of it as this mango and kiwi one Oh, it smells so so good this with this oh now you're talking dirt to me body care is very very important and i encourage all of you guys to look after your body like this is the body you have look after it be nice to be kind to your body you know next i have got the stainless steel foot file cousins this this right here is a dangerous dangerous weapon you guys might think kemi this is just a foot scrub no 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 no. this is not a regular regular schmegler foot scrub okay this is the foot scrub of life right here this was 10 pounds you might be thinking kemi why the hell would you spend 10 pounds on this when you can get it from like the pound shop or like i don't know where else you can get it from but those one pound ones they are not the truth trust me when i say those ones are not the truth this is the true daddy of them all i love this scrub but cousins you need to be careful with this the first time i used this i got so carried away that i actually ended up hurting my feet because i scrubbed so hard because i was so excited of all the dead skin coming off that i scraped a bit too hard my leg was sore for days this part is so sharp that it will literally make your dead skin look like spaghetti the way this like scrapes off everything if you end up getting this do not use it too much please please be careful when you use this it will give you that baby feet that you want but you just need to be careful with it because it will literally scrape off everything i use this once every two because i cannot do this every week because it will end up hurting my feet like i mentioned earlier my feet was something i don't normally take care of because i'm too busy you know working or like just doing other stuff that i neglect my feet but now i've incorporated it into my monthly maintenance so i make sure that i do my feet at least once a month ideally i want to push for twice a month but if not that definitely once a month it looks like it doesn't do much but it does a lot i don't go to the nail salon anymore because i don't know i just prefer to do it myself and i have my foot massage and everything at home so i just like to do that myself but if you obviously if you don't want to you can just go to the spa and they will do it for you but if you want to do it yourself get this i used to use this electric pedicure device and yes i still use it to this day and i loved this for years i recently purchased this one about six months ago and i've been using this more because it's just easier for me to use than me charging up this device i would say this device is way more gentle and it has everything you need and more it has a filer mine's a little bit nasty but this is what it's meant to look like <laughs> So what I like to do now is go in with this in the shower and then once I'm out of the shower I like to just use this to like smooth out everything because this can create some like uneven smoothness. Comes in two settings, just press like this and if you want it to be a little bit more higher, just press it like that. And you just like graze it around the back of your feet to make it like smooth and baby skin like. This one's quite gentle but it does take a lot of time but this one's quite quick but it's quite harsh on your feet since we're in the topic in the bathroom i recently purchased this seven in one electric cleaning brush cousins when i say this is a lifesaver in terms of cleaning your bathroom cleaning your windows it's an electric scrubber like it literally just gets through all the dirt all the gunk it has seven different heads in here which you can use to mop the floor clean your toilet clean your shower clean your windows clean your car it comes like this it has two settings as well obviously you put the head that you want on here this one you just plug it in like that and then literally so instead of like using your hand to like you know scrub and like clean this does it all for you i am all about soft life i do not want anything that makes my life hard cleaning the bathroom now has become a lot 
a lot more easier I am not dragging my hands trying to scrub away I have this to do it for me this does have like an extender so you can extend it and you like use it to mop the floor that's in the bathroom and I can't bother to grab it right now but yeah this baby is amazing alhamdulillah I get a lot of questions on how I keep my teeth white a lot of people ask me do I get my teeth whitened cousins I do not use any like whitening strip or like whitening whatever people use I do want to do because I've been drinking a lot of coffee as of late and I feel like it's staining my teeth a little bit so I don't want that but the main product that I have been using since I had teeth <laughs> is a toothbrush but the toothbrush that I use is a hard toothbrush and mine is by Wisdom Tooth. I have been using the Wisdom Smoker toothbrush for years. Obviously, I'm talking about the brand, not one toothbrush. I switch out my toothbrush like every two months. I like my toothbrush to be hard, like I don't do soft toothbrush because I feel like it's not really getting my teeth clean. I've tried them out multiple times, but I just don't like them that's why i love hard head toothbrushes these toothbrushes are aimed for people that smoke obviously i do not smoke so if i don't smoke and i'm using a smoker brush clearly my teeth is gonna be white i feel like every african person has a wisdom toothbrush because it's just like a must have in the household. I used to use the white one with that the like orangey bronzy you know brush i feel like people start making fakes of those and like the last time i used it which was a couple years ago it was soft i was like uh -uh, what is this but well, luckily i actually find the wisdom company on amazon and i've been purchasing from them for the past like two years now i get a pack of six or the pack of 12 depending on which one they have available so that we can last me for a couple months the majority of the time i just use this but sometimes when i get that extra cleanliness i do use my oral b electric toothbrush i use it to like get in between my teeth on like places that this one doesn't reach whilst we're on the topic of mouth and mouth hygiene you will definitely need a tongue scraper please 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 i feel like a lot of people brush their teeth and forget their tongue i don't know how but a tongue scraper is an essential for me just literally just put it in and just scrape your tongue. Oral hygiene is a must. Like we need to honestly start taking care of, you know, what's getting into our mouth and cleaning our mouth as well. The last one that I have been loving for my oral hygiene is a water flosser. I bloody love water flossing. Like I feel like it's so fun. I like to do it, especially on days that, you know, obviously my mom's cooked an amazing meal, but you know, sometimes the meat be getting stuck in your teeth. So after like I floss and like try to take the meat out, I go with my water flosser just to make sure there's no food like stuck in between my teeth. The pressure of the water is like cleaning in between my teeth and I love this one because it has like five mode and you can choose like the pressure of how you want the water to be pushing through your teeth. So the next category that I want to talk about is home essentials and deco. Okay so one of the products that I find that has changed my room are these shoe organizers. I was having so much problem in like how to store my shoes because I don't want to keep them in a box anymore because I forget the type of heels that I have and then I end up buying the same ones. I got these clear box shoe organizers that honestly are just amazing. They just fit on top of my wardrobe so perfectly. I can see what heels I have and it's just so organized and it just keeps my room looking so clean. I just love it because it made my life so much easier. I can see what shoes I have. Next is this mirror trays. I have so many of these around my room. It comes in two sizes. This is the smaller version. I use these to like organize like my cream, my vitamins, my sticky notes and pens. Like I use this just to like keep everything, just to keep like the little loose product a bit organized it just makes my room look a little bit more cleaner a little more classy like everything's put into place and it's not like just loose products everywhere because before everything was just like on my countertop and it looked quite messy but with this it just made it look a little bit more cleaner and it looks like it was like the products are meant to be there you wouldn't think you would need this but honestly they do make a big change in organizing your room since i had these my countertop is always clean and if anything comes out of it i know exactly where it's meant to be that is why i love these and i would definitely recommend you guys to put this up if you don't have it already this year i actually found out that amazon has some hidden gems i normally don't go to amazon for like jewelry or like clothes 
but as of late i have been finding some really cute pieces from amazon like the earrings i'm wearing right now this little hoop earring i say these are not real gold so you can't like shower with them or like put perfume on them and you do need to like switch them out quite frequently i love fake jewelry because i love like the designs of them and i found out that amazon has some pretty good jewelry pieces like my nose ring is from amazon as well but one of the favorite things i go for my jewelry is my jewelry organizers they're in my drawer right now so i do a little montage right here honestly love them it keeps everything in place i don't have to worry about losing like my earrings or like my bracelet because they're all in one place and the other thing that i love is this ring organizer would you believe me if i tell you there's a hundred rings in here it doesn't look like it does it i love the fact i can see all my rings in here it makes my life easier in like sorting out my rings because there's so many and i i cannot imagine just having these out loose honestly this is one of my favorite favorite purchases from amazon because it just makes my life so much easier the way i was keeping my rings before cousins it was the ghetto like the absolute ghetto i need to purchase another one because this one is full now and i have more rings to like store and then lastly one of my favorite favorite purchases is this mini light from amazon this is the best thing ever if you're a content creator or you like to take pictures this is the best thing for you all you have to do is attach it to your phone turn on the light it comes in with three settings. You can have it mixed with like white light and warm light, or you can just have it with white light or just warm light. You can dim it down. I don't know if you can see that. This is honestly like the perfect product for anyone that's creating content or taking pictures or just want really good lighting on the go. It's so flat, you can pop it in your bag. It's an on the go light. If you don't have this, get it because it will honestly make your life easier. You can attach this to your camera. Hold on. I'm gonna turn on my ring light. I'm gonna turn off my ring light. And I'm gonna turn this on. I'm gonna put it up bright. Cause look how bright that is. This is literally just from the handheld light. I could have filmed the whole video with just this light. Look how powerful it is. It's honestly just amazeballs. I honestly just love this. This will be included in my tech category down below. You'll find all my tech products there. From a laptop to my mic to tripods to chargers, um, lights, everything you need about tech and how I film my videos is all there. These are just a few of my favorite Amazon purchases that I have been loving for years and I wanted to share with you guys. And this is pretty much it cousin for today's video. Inshallah, I plan to do this by the end of each month to share with you guys my new current favorite Amazon finds that I have been loving. So make sure you stay tuned for those. So if you're new, make sure you subscribe down below. So yeah, that is pretty much it for today's video cousins. Let me know what you think about my Amazon finds is there any that you want to try out or is there any that you already have let me know down below let's have a little conversation i love you guys so much and inshallah i'll catch you guys in my next video bye cousins Mwah.